Faculty and staff now without jobs and students left hanging at one of Oklahoma's oldest colleges. Two works for you, the first to break the story after the president of Bacon College revealed that the school is out of money. Our reporter Tony Russell is live in Muskogee tonight and Tony, the students have to be up in arms over this. The students are shocked, some wondering if they'll be able to have classes, others wanting to know if they'll be able to spend the summer here. It's May. Schools and colleges are winding down their spring semester. But at Bacon College, we've run out of money. Bacon College's outgoing president saying the historic campus in Muskogee could be closed for one to three weeks. We got kids graduating. We got kids supposed to graduate next year. You know what I'm saying? Like, are you just telling us this? Like, where are we supposed to go? You know what I'm saying? What are we supposed to do? All we got to do, like I said, I'm a senior, I got one more semester left, I'm just trying to graduate and move on, you know what I'm saying, you know, this school got so much money out of me already, you know what I'm saying, so I'm just still trying to just be faithful, not trying to give up because, you know, this is frustrating. Like a lot of people in my situation got one more semester left, so with that being said, you know, it's like we put we putting in that hard work, putting in that time, you know what I'm saying, we, we want answers. President Frank Willis says the new president is working to secure funding to fill a $2 million budget hole. Uh, if uh, if those sources of support don't come in, we will have to close Bay Cone, the, the, the oldest school in the state. It will be a true tragedy. Now the concern turns to around 95 faculty who won't have a job and international students who are looking for a place to stay and continue their education. We had that money. We'd be open. It's the two million we need and there'd be not a care in the world. Uh, a lot of my friends, you know, not in school, not in college, don't play football, not doing nothing with their lives. You know, I'm sitting up there trying to be something. I want to be something one day, you know. But I don't know, I just feel like that just gave us false dreams. President Willis says that there will be graduation for those seniors on Saturday. I have the full interview. I did a Facebook Live with him on our KJRH Facebook page. Reporting live in Muskogee, Tony Russell, Two Works For You.